The next phase of setting up to run the service is to get the TVMate app set up here on this screen. So you can run it. That's the app that actually makes everything work. So from this screen, we've already plugged in the TV, the device to the TV. Then we configured the device, and now we're going to add the app to the device. So we're going to go from this screen down to your apps, and we're going to go all the way over to the right to add apps and select that. New screen comes up. So again, we're going to go down to app categories. And we're going to find TV Mate under video players and editors. So choose that. And then we're going to go over to the right until we see TV Mate highlighted, which it is. We're going to select that. We're going to choose to install it. And I'm going to fast forward here. Okay, we're back. That was actually fairly quick. So we are now going to choose to open the TV Mate player. And so it wants to get a setting configured. So we're going to click the uh, select button, go to settings. And we're going to scroll all the way down to where we see TV Mate. And we're going to enter, turn that on. And then we're going to use the back button to go back. And now we're going to add a playlist. Now, this is where the rubber meets the road between the website where you set up your account and adding a playlist. Once we add the playlist, then you'll have access to all of the programming. So we're going to select playlist here, and we're going to go down to stalker portal, select it. And now there's two things in particular we're going to set up here. We're going to set the server address, and then we're going to put that Mac address. I've got it blurred out here. Uh, so you don't accidentally use it because it's the one uh, that should be showing on your TV. But that MAC ad address is going to go in the website. So the first thing to do is set the server address. The server address will always be the same. So we're going to select that. And then I'm going to fast forward, but we'll let you see what the address should be. Okay, so we've fast forwarded through all that typing. You see the address here. That should be the address that you put on for our service on yours. Then we're going to click this guy here. We're going to click the back button that gets rid of the keyboard. And so now we should see the server address right there. And then on our website where you will put in this Mac address. So let's do that now. Okay. Now that we're back over to the TV, we see the server address is correct. We see the Mac address matches what we put in on the website. So we can go over to next and choose select, and the processing begins. And this will take a few minutes, so I'm going to fast forward again, but once it's finished, it's going to tell you some numbers in terms of how many movies, TV shows, that kind of thing. Okay, the playlist is processed. We have 4,500 channels, 90,000 movies, 17,000 TV shows, and everything is set. So I'm going to go over to done, select that. And then it's going to load the very beginnings of TV mate where you can see the programming. And it's here that you can begin using the TV mate app. We'll have a different video that explains the ins and outs of using TV mate, but it's at this point it's running.